Well, we continue our storm team coverage this half hour in Wood County, where East Texans have been preparing all week for this wintry mix. Fox 51's Tori Bean visited a hardware store today as customers rushed in before the cold arrived. True Value Store Manager Scott Dunson Equipment says customers are rushing to the store for the necessities. Last time, I don't think people got as prepared as they are this time. And I know we probably weren't prepared in inventory, but we are make sure we have everything for our customers and make sure that we have what they need to get through this. His business has posted on social media warning customers to call first before coming to the store, stressing to people to cover their pipes and let their faucets drip to avoid issues. If anything were to happen like a busted pipe, they have their stock built up ready to go, even giving customers bright colored flags to mark where their water shutoff is. Because that was a big problem last time. A lot of people experienced a lot of water loss because they couldn't find their water cut off. A bright colored flag stake like this this would be easier to find in snow or ice if you need to shut off your water. We are more interested currently uh, trying to keep our water supply up and running and our uh, wastewater system up and running. Mineola is making sure they have all supplies ready in case the worst was to hit. Last year, they were able to not issue a bull notice and hope to keep their water safe again. If the, their personal water pipes freeze and bust, they need to let us know and we'll get somebody out there as soon as possible. The winter weather isn't predicted to be as bad as last year, but no one wants to chance it. That's why people like Scott are here to help get you through it. Tori Bean, Fox 51 News. Wood County Electric Cooperative also says they have crews on standby to fix any power outages caused by the weather. They do have an agreement with other co-ops in case they need more help.